Can you say welcome to the vlog? Ghosts? Good boy. So since you guys are such big fans of Lionel on the vlog, I figured I'd start this one here today. I found this in the bag that they gave back to me after we boarded Lionel. He goes to this awesome daycare place when we were in Montana and he had a little doggy report card and they didn't used to do that. He got an A plus for eating. Oh, you are your father's son. Good boy. He rests as needed. He's sweet and kind. He was great at listening. A plus for potty time. You are your father's son. And his best bud is named Winnie. Winnie Cooper. I mean, our year was made. I'll never forget that. That was amazing. So Lionel, pretty flawless report card, I gotta say. His favorite thing is to go to the lake, and I think we should reward him. You wanna go for a walk? He gone. <laughs> we also tell everybody the vlog sponsored by Darcy Deming. Can you say today's vlog sponsored by Darcy Deming? You have a lot of wisdom in your beard, don't you? Darcy, this one's for you. Thank you so much. All right, another lakeside review. It's a cloudy but 60 and I'm still gonna call it a gorgeous day in Chicago and I'm finally getting it I, I saw it this photo of this thing on the Foxtrot app which is basically like fancy 7-eleven in Chicago a bunch of locations the Gold Coast location near me had these so here's the photo once again and then here's the reveal of what it looks like IRL bang <laughs> uh, I mean it definitely a good-looking bun Lionel your thoughts <laughs> where's that sausage all right there we go so this is all locally sourced. Tempesta sausage, the cheese, the egg, everything comes from farms here in Chicago. As you might have seen on that page too, this thing was $8. So an $8 sausage, egg, and cheese from a counter, a takeout. Let's see if this thing's worth it. Let's see if it's worth eight bucks. It's very soft bun. It smells incredible. Let's go. There's a sweetness to it right away, which is kind of wild. It's a gorgeous sandwich. Sausage, egg, and cheeses to me don't need to be very fancy. Like, it can be very simple and good, but this tastes so high class. One of the best buns I've ever had on a breakfast sandwich. So light and airy. Look at that, there's a cheese caramelization on there. I'm glad I finally did it. You like it? High five if it's good. High five if it's good. Hey. No, sir. That's good, Allie's take. This tastes very good. Bless you. Is it worth $8? I mean, it's nice that it's still hot and that we can enjoy it by the water. That is worth $8. All right, much later in the day at Wolf Den Brewing for Mike's, another celebration of life. This is where he used to work, great friend of mine, that now we're gonna celebrate. While my friend Mike's journey ended way, way too early, celebrating his life has helped me remember to cherish my own every single day. Cheers. Cheers. Bird beer. Bird beer. Bird beer. All right, so Mike always talked about how he wanted to brew a beer with pumpkin seeds and bird seeds. He said, why couldn't it be done? Why couldn't it be done? So that he did it. Well, they did it for Mike, and it's oddly great. A very big moment. It's a very big moment. And through Mike and our silly little internet vlogs, I've connected with so many unbelievable people, including Courtney and Angela, who I finally got to meet IRL for the very first time. And naturally, impromptu beer reviews with the Midwest Brew Review Boys. It's kind of got... It tastes like a lager, but it has like a almost a bitter taste. Is that is it bitter? I agree. Yep. Okay. And then yeah, and then bitter, right at kind of the end too. That was I'm like thinking, a legitimate review. That was a legitimate review. Right at the end, there's a little sweetness that I didn't know about. Let's get a close Let's see. Let's see. Sip it. Let's see how oh. do you Pinkies up, right? Yeah. Oh uh, no, it's. Not. I'm actually shocked that it turned out. I know. <laughs> I'm actually shocked. I didn't know that. I really like this beer because they go down very fast, very quick. Uh, he's on his third one. <laughs> it tastes like if you took like a little bit of sugar and dropped it into a Bud Light. 
Like a little sugar cube. A Mike sugar cubist. Cubes. And naturally times two in Mike's honor, a round of Jepson's Malort shots just for him. <laughs> Here we go, boys. Yeah. To Mike. To Mike. Oh. Cheers. Cheers, boys. Cheers. What the fucking heck is that stuff bad? <laughs> it burns. Yeah. Thanks, Kyle. Yeah. Yeah. Tastes better here than it is. Tastes better with you right next to me. That's <laughs> Thank you, Kyle. That's Anytime. great. Oh, that might be the best shot I've ever taken. It's so good. Mike's vlog. And finally, before hitting the road, we had to hit the burger pop-up on site for one final food feature on the vlog. This man knows the way to my heart. It's the salt drizzle. I mean, I'm like a magnet. I see a chef on a flat top grill, I'm attaching myself immediately. <laughs> All right, this is Nice Buns, which is a pop-up here at Wolf Den today. I'm assuming they can, you can like hire them and they'll pop up wherever. I would imagine right? so, yeah. So they had three different types of burgers. The crazy thing about this, though, is the bow bun, which I've never seen used as a hamburger bun in my life. I love bows. It is quite literally sliced in half. This is the <laughs> second angle of this. Second angle. But look at this thing. I mean, it's gorgeous. It's almost like a little bigger than a slider. Yeah. I would say, but I've never seen, and I got the spicy one, uh, which this is called what the burning burning, burning den, den I think. burning den. Yeah. It's got like sriracha mayo on it, pepper jack cheese. That's pretty good. I want to eat it. I'm very excited. It looks wild because that's what Mike would have wanted. That's very good. Wow. I love that sauce. The meat on that like black stone, probably some of my favorite way to like smash that down. Salt and pepper. It's cooked in like five minutes. That's great. That's I awesome. mean, this is smart. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. That's good. That's very smart. Yeah. That's smart business. Yeah. So like, can you buy like bow buns at the grocery store? And then could you do this? Could I you just no slice idea. them? I've like I have never. No idea. I know. Like, where do you get bow bun made? You know, pre-made bow buns. I don't right. Know. Oh, the jalapeno kicking That's in there so, too. It's got jalapenos so. on it. That's damn good. And they're pickled, and I still love it. Right. This worked out great. You ordered the white one? Nice buns, nice oh, job. Mike and Beans? Oh, yeah. Now let's get Courtney's take. This is the Mike's, Mike and Beans. I think it's called, it has beans, and there's pork belly bits in there, and pimento cheese. Wow. I like that we all got different ones. Yeah, let's go for it. You might, you might have picked wrong. <laughs> this is really good. I bet it's so good. This is really good. That cheese is amazing. And beans are pork and beans. But, yeah, that cheese really, really makes it happen. And it's cooked medium well. Yeah, it does look like it's, yeah. Out of five Mike's vlogs. How many Mike's vlogs? Oh, we'll give it five. Oh, oh sure. damn. You have to. Yeah. Uh, today, today? What are some good words of wisdom? Hey, enjoy life. Meet as many people as you can. Um, say hi to everybody. Smile, laugh, and uh, Mike's vlog forever. That was just sincere. I love you. It was great seeing you. I'm going to go back home. Right. Good seeing you. Thank you for everything again. I, Absolutely. I, you know, Mike, Mike treasured you guys. Uh, he's the best, man. It's just amazing. Hi, the Courtney. Next, the next See you Zoom. soon. The next Zoom, we're all Bye, Bye, buddy. Bye. So I think I've had like eight bird beards. I'm sure Sean will cut in some sort of backstory or recipe <laughs> of what the bird of why beard, the bird beard the a bird thing. beard was. Why it was a thing and why you had seven of them. But come out to Wolf Den. I hope they keep it rolling. Hey. Hey, that's really rude. To yell. Now Screw. we gotta reshoot. This. Now we gotta reshoot this whole thing. I'm gonna flatten these tires. <laughs> <laughs> bye, Amy. Bye. I know man. Passing by, life is good, best I've ever felt. Get me up, so in, somewhere I can find myself. Oh, I feel, I feel, I feel, I feel so alive. We did it! Holy shit! <laughs> good pickup! <laughs> Oh my god, okay, that's good. Hot. I came to Chicago and all I got was this lousy tongue burn. <laughs>